I want to show you guys something brand new that since everything waterfalls, it's the ultimate waterfall display outdoor where your stuff is eventually, well, you want to see it outdoors. It doesn't make sense to have it inside. But as far as our swim pool waterfall kits and just regular pool waterfalls, what we did is we implemented some options. Options that you don't need to take, but they're there because a lot of people don't see some of the other really cool things that we can add to the to the swimming pool. And unlike a lot of other places that sell different uh, alternatives and stuff, they're just mainly into the waterfall. I'm more or less, hey, let's bring the garden to the edge of your pool because a lot of times there's a lot of downtime. You want to look out and see the different things. So some of the cool things that I want to show you is is pot rocks and you're building behind your waterfall you're adding some of these with where you can put some pots in uh, there's doubles there's bigger ones there's even stuff that looks like this and this is here just to put your pots in there it sort of looks like you know, if you're up in the mountains you see different things growing out of your rocks another thing what it does is you can put rock or your plants behind it Put this up against it and it hides that and you can also hide that but i have it as kits or collections there's three of them on every single pool waterfall and kit that way if you want to do this behind and add some of your tropical plants you can call it an oasis it looks kind of neat instead of just having maybe a singular waterfall or the kit that has just the two again optional what's another cool product that uh, a lot of people are asking about is these fantastic looking accent rods and believe me these are cool and, and you would put these behind uh, so if you're in the swimming pool it would be behind your uh, water feature and you can see the makeup and, and again every single pool waterfall has different ones so this isn't going to be offered with a small one because more like most likely when you have a smaller one you want smaller rocks the bigger ones i think i set this one up with more of the medium ones same way with this one this is and when you get into adding some of these real cool ones like this it adds a little bit more to it and also these are all taken from real rock formation so it's not that garbage that you see where somebody just throws something together and it is what it is these here are really unique uh, done by an artist that does a lot of the landscaping and came up with this really excellent idea of using a combination of polymers that really makes the ultimate waterfall. And here's another one that I added, and this is cool. When you have a pool, and this is also going for a lot of other things such as our patios and even rock gardens, but when you're at a, in a pool, what would you like? A cooler. So this one here opens up to be a cooler. Just like what you see it, it floats. You can have it on the side. What would you put in here? Heck, you can put water, put uh, snacks for the kids, whether it's pudding or maybe some yogurt, jello. You can put all kinds of stuff in there for the day. Have it float around. You swim up to it, you open it up, and you got it. Thing. So that's a couple of the different things that we added on as optional features that you can get that you may not know. And another thing with these, this is pretty cool, it's got handles, but anyways, by, by putting these with the waterfalls that has to come on a skid anyway, we're just basically making your skid more powerful or, or more uh, easier to include these without added shipping. So if you add wanted to buy these separate, then there'd be additional shipping. But we're, I'm trying to make it so, hey, I want a waterfall, I got to different edge rocks, maybe I can put a couple of these accent rocks, maybe I can even get a couple pot rocks. Again, here's a cool cooler that goes excellent uh, with the, the pool waterfalls. So.